All right, guys, this is Rambo 145. I want to see how good this uh, JCB uh, welder will load, like how much it can lift. So let's go ahead and try to lift some logs here. With this remodified clamp that I have. Oh, it works pretty well. About to lose some logs here. There we go. Oh. Huh. Kind of, uh, they're all just scattered, but oh well. I'll see if I can get this log here down. Always has to be one log. This trailer ain't the best. I'm gonna redo it. I put a gooseneck hitch on it. So this way you can color it. So whatever color you pick, the the neck will be the same color. Or pretty close to that. No, same color. Alright, cool. We're not going to get that log. We'll try to scoot this one up here. Oh. There we go. Alright, so I think I'm going to go ahead and uh, drive it on over here and grab some more logs and drive the truck over here. Get the truck here. Okay, so now we have that kind of moved out. Let's go ahead and try to shush this log on up here. Oh no, I, oh, I just wrecked it. I can't, I can't use inside the cab. Huh. There we go. Awesome. They're kind of long logs, but oh well. I love that backup sound. I think that sounds so cool. I'm just so so glad they took and actually let you use the normal stuff for this. Unlike the skid steer buckets and all that stuff. So it's kind of in its own little category. Well, this thing works really, really good. See if I can grab these logs here. Kind of in a funky spot. Oh no. There we go. 
See if we can handle these. Well, it has like a little turbo sound, I think, too. Oh, got way off on that. Oh, no. Oh, man, I just dropped him and pushed the wrong button. Oh, wow. They're out here. I can work with them now. They could have made the arms a little faster, up and down-wise. Of course, I'm using the Xbox controller, too, so... I mean... Might be different with the mouse. I don't know. I'll check that out in a second. All right, so here I'll turn my mouse all the way up. Should be pretty fast. There we go. That's the fast one. That goes up pretty fast with the mouse, as long as you have a mouse that wouldn't uh, let you. Uh, Turn it up. Probably if he's loading normal logs, he probably wouldn't have this problem. But I don't load normal logs. <laughs> I guess I could just to show, but ah, there we go. Now I think I broke. Now I think I messed my other log up up here on the front. I wonder how this thing looks when it's dirty. If it gets dirty, I'm sure it does. There we go. Oh wow, wrote a willy there, kinda. So, I think you can hook up stuff to the back. At least it looks like that. Let's try that out. Maybe it's just different things. I don't know. Not sure. Okay, that is really odd. They put an attacher, but you can't hook up to nothing. Oh, here we go. Here's some logs. Let's try this again one more time inside the cab. Ah, nah. It's all confusing. I got going on. Yeah, I guess I got it. That's cool. I don't usually use stuff inside the cab, so. Oh, I got. Oh, no. Uh, what is going on here? Oh, man. I'm over. I'm not balanced right. I'll just I'll just hit everything. I don't drive equipment like this in real life, just so you all know. It's nice and slow and nothing gets broke.
All right, let's uh I'm gonna try to get this thing dirty and then I'll be back Okay guys as you can see it is taking a long time to get dirty I drove it around quite a bit and I've messed around in the dirt here Just ain't gonna get dirty. So we're just gonna keep on Loading logs here or moving logs around with it This thing right here is in my way. It's chipper So we're gonna try to move it out of the way I go this way. I don't know if it if I follow my clamp though. It works pretty well. All right, so that it's probably good there. I've just been getting these logs out of here. They've been here forever. I just have not messed with getting them out. Wow, it hangs up on mother logs, but that's okay. What doesn't, though? I kind of like this loader. This loader is pretty cool. I like the high lift arms on it. Or whatever you want to call those. Oh, I can see this is going to be a disaster. Okay, let me uh, let's get these other, get these two out of here. Actually, yeah, I was going to go up and scoot them, but probably end up having issues. So I'm probably better off just to go ahead and just pick them up, move them out of here. You know, I don't know if you all think the DLC is worth it. In a way it is, in a way it's not. I like the loader. The loader is worth it. Uh, but, I mean, it all depends what you're looking for as equipment-wise. The skid steers and all that stuff, the skid steer is pretty, pretty okay. Alright guys, I forgot where I was at. I had to stop because uh, I thought somebody was here. The dogs was going crazy. And yeah, but it wasn't. It was someone coming out of the driveway somewhere else, across the road. Live way out here in the middle of nowhere, so like it's very, you know, so not a lot of traffic that comes out of driveways. Okay, so now I uh, forget where I was at. I, I was, but anyway, I'm just kind of moving this stuff. But anyway, I think I was talking about the DLC. The, it was pretty sad the DLC only like the buckets and all the attachments only lets you use it for the skid steer not for the front end loader and you can't go and change it because then people would put it out and then they would never sell no DLC uh, so that's kind of makes it sad maybe later on they'll release the you know after the DLC goes on like really cheap or something maybe about a year or so or whatever maybe they'll let everybody have access to the tools and stuff to mod them how they want to. That'd be pretty cool. Of course then again if he's just really good you could just probably pretty much copy their pattern and make it yourself but it won't be the same. It will never be the same as what they have. I mean you can get it close but it just won't be the same. Well, probably not. I wouldn't think. I mean, I wouldn't know why anybody would want to make take the time and effort to do something that's already out there. You know, make it. You know, only thing, like I said, maybe the attachers and stuff, but. Maybe I have my dirt on slow, where it's like actually taking a long time to get dirty. Oh. 
Our struggles go up a hill, but that's a pretty steep hill. Oh no! Alright, get up there. Oh, there we go. There we go. Awesome. Oh wow, I just drove over the top of a stump. That's amazing. Yeah, I like this loader. This loader is pretty cool. They did a really awesome job on it. Okay, so I'm going to get the truck and bring it down here. I have to fix this trailer. Like, stuff wants to roll through the sides. I tried to fix it so you could use skid steers, but now it's like messed up where the COLs are not high enough or something. Uh, I'm not sure where I'm going to put this trailer. Maybe we'll just put it right through here. There we go. Ah, uh, that'll probably work. Back end's up off the ground. Oh well. So, I gotta go fix this stupid log again. Ah. Well, that's gonna be about as good as gonna get. So let's see how many logs we can actually scoop here. These are normal average log size I mean not really but ah. oh no oh man I messed that up let's try that again There we go. That works. <laughs> oh my. Alright, so we have two, four, five, six kind of logs in there. Of course, we're on a hill though, too. So, I mean, this is kind of bad planning on my part but it's about like trying to back a track loader up a hill backwards with a car lifted on the front of it small one just doesn't work out too hot here we go oh yeah oh we're gonna this ain't good this is this is bad bad planning for me alright So let's go. Oh, goodness. They could have put just a little bit more weight on the back of this. Oh, gosh. This is a bad deal. All right. There we go. We're kind of lined up with it. Let's go ahead and just, uh... Run oh! This thing is just going bonker nuts. There we go. It doesn't help to be stuck on this stupid, uh... wheel, or log, whatever.
Wow, I actually got him on there. <laughs> So, it probably worked fine if he wasn't on an incline. Uh, normally you're not going to be on a hill loading logs. Well, I don't... I mean, like... What do they call those? Uh, oh, you know where they all take the logs at? Yeah, I forget the name. Landing or something like that? There's three. Let's see if we can straighten them up. Yeah. Why in the world are they like sliding down? There we go. All right. That's pretty good. That, uh, those are pretty good sized logs though. I mean, you wouldn't be uh, really picking them up. Well, I guess you would, but this is kind of a mid small loader. I would, I would guess compared to other ones. I don't know how much more I can... I'm going to try to put this others on there. I'll probably lose half of this as I go out because those sides are messed up. There I am getting them all crooked again. Yeah. All right. Maybe there's an invisible one there. Maybe that's what's going on. Kind of looks that way. I think they fixed a lot of that though. Like when the game first came out, you had these uh, invisible logs that you would actually have to cut and not see them. Yeah, like here's one right here. We have one. It's okay, we're going to load it up, but I'm not going to show you, because I hated them trees so bad. Like, you cut one, and be like, pop three or four of them out, or about, or more, so, alright. Good thing we're out in the country, huh? Yeah. cops would have a heyday with that uh, F-350 truck pulling that big gooseneck full of logs. Maybe like you're overweight. Way overweight. Yes I am, I know this, but that's the only way I can make money. Alright, let's try to get this trailer out of here. You guys, you guys gotta remember this truck is not out yet. It, there's some like it, but this is just one I'm testing out. Trying to get the turbo sounds to be right and the pulling. I'm trying to get it where it blows black smoke when you take off and you're pulling and it starts shifting up and you're not blowing as much. But I haven't had no luck. I've had it where it just blows straight black smoke or gray or no black smoke. And the pulling pulls pretty good. All tires turn. Kind of slides around. So we'll take this over there and get some, uh, money for this or try to offload this all 
Uh, we'll go up this way here. If I don't roll it first, I think I'm going to save it right here. <laughs> because I don't want it to... In case I roll it, I can just go right back. And we'll just go up this road. We'll take the back roads. Less traffic. Oh no, it's more logs. <laughs> I'll just try to drive over them. Oh, that's probably a mistake. Never mind. Okay, and now it worked okay. Pretty wide. Wow, my frames drop. It's dropping like hardcore right through here. Okay, it's better. It doesn't even feel like I'm going that fast. A little squirrely. Oh, here comes a van. Oh my goodness. Oops, didn't need that anyway. This curve right here will flip you, or make you lose logs every time. Ah. I might adjust the brakes on this trailer a little bit because it seems like they don't really want to stop. Okay, so I'm just going to back them off in the water or try to. Alright. See if I can get stuck here. Oh my goodness. Alright, now let's see if we can get out of here. Uh oh. That's too low. There we go. Oh, we're gonna get it out of here. There we go. Yeah. Oh, we're not going that way. That way is like a killer. That's a big trailer. That's a pretty good sized trailer for that uh, truck. I just don't like that turbo sound. I, I just, something about it I just don't like. I mean, like, it has this, that cutting out. I don't know. Oh, there's a bell of hay, huh? We'll go back here. We're getting some good speed up now. It pulls pretty well for being a truck with a trailer on the back of it. So anyway, I'm 
Let's go ahead and uh, move this trailer out somewhere. See, then I had a truck where you could push the, like if you was using an Xbox controller, you could hold middle, your, your, your trigger, my bad, down halfway. And when you would give it gas, just barely halfway, it would go. It blow kind of clearish white, well, whitish gray smoke. Then when you want to go a little faster, you just push it all the way down and it would start chucking the black smoke out. But it was really hard to use with the keyboard. It was annoying. And it didn't really go fast. And, you know, it worked okay for just going. But anyway, this is Ramble145. I uh, hope you guys like my videos. Please hit that like button, subscribe, and share. Thanks. Bye.